Feature Friday. The freshest. <laughs> Okay, so uh, if you haven't tuned in, so Father uh, is going to be joining me today. <laughs> and, uh, cause Here Vales I am again. Do you remember when I replaced him? Yeah. Because he was in bed. Yeah. So and now Valeska. That's right. Is in bed. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Look, we, look, we, actually, we actually see the exact same. Um, um, some of our expressions are like bizarrely the same, dude. Really? Yeah. Uh, by the I, way, I wonder why. <laughs> but it's as if I was your son. I don't know. <laughs> Some people ask why the accents in the home are very different. So father spent a lot of time in US, in the US, yeah, especially New York. Sorry about that. And uh, but he learned it there. Uh, so ballet probably has a more international accent. Yeah. Um, even though she did do theatre here, and mm. I, and there was some encouragement for her to to. Uh, pick up more of an RP pronunciation of things, which is, yeah. just means received pronunciation, mm -hmm. uh, which is kind of like how the Queen speaks, but not really. Um, and then mother, she learned English in South America. So she taught it as a as an actual uh, uh, as subject. That's Sally. So like more of a perhaps a Latin accent. English as a second language. Exactly. But yeah. mine, I learned it in Britain. So I picked it up here and then I started hanging around with tennis players. You can imagine what accent would come up. <laughs> yeah. um, but anyways, this is one of the Philippines' biggest stars at the moment. And okay. One of my favorite performances that we checked out in the last couple of weeks is called Amaka Boguera, Amaka Boguera, which means like uh, to slay, to be confident and do you regardless of what other people say. Uh, and her name is Mai Mai Entrata. Okay. This is the full video. We haven't checked this out. I did check out the performance on Wish, but she is very good live. Let's so go. this is to see the production value of the video. I think it's quite funny, I don't know. She also like models and stuff. That was funny, dude. That beginning. Yeah, but the video production joke. Is that beginning it's actually Huge. a joke life and in the recording i that's mental something that happens in the philippines sometimes is that i enjoy the live version sometimes better than the than the studio version mental wow. isn't it yeah it is. but anyways go on well that happened to me when when i heard first time uh, kc yeah yeah oh she oh damn mate i can't wait she killed me yeah i cannot wait she killed me when i saw that first uh video on uh, live yeah i cannot wait to watch she, a live yeah, she, she did something that I have never seen before. Yeah, she's next level. She turned a cover herself. Yeah, yeah. And she did it, you know, amazing. Yeah, yeah. That's Tagalog. Yeah. Yeah, but production wise is amazing joke. Charisma. <laughs> Amaka Boguera isn't actually a word though. That's like a, it's like slang. Okay. Yeah, but but, but the rest is Tagalog. She's, she's an authentic person. Yeah, yeah. She's saying like yeah, like original. Me, the the, the unique. I guess. All right. Yes, I can. I can give you a translation later if you want. Okay. However, Amaka Boguera isn't an actual word though. It's more like slang. It's it's like Nawara. Like how the fuck do you explain that what to yes. someone? You know what I mean? It's I like it, I got it now. You know, yeah. yeah. Or, or or like chuliao or something yeah. like that. <laughs> you know <what> I'm <laughs> First 
time I've seen her dance. Yeah, but she must be very outstanding. She must be very outstanding to receive that type of production. Oh yeah, yeah, she's a big deal. She's very famous. The scenery is amazing. She's a very well invested artist. Certainly, good production. Yes. We have seen at least five different stations. Yeah. I mean, she certainly is. <laughs> she's. <laughs> she certainly is like uh, someone uh, who's who's, who's uh, an entertainer. It seems. Uh, I'm not very familiar with her. I've never. Mm -hmm. Uh, they, it was the first time we very checked her young, out before. Very young. It seems so. Yes, uh, I think she's my it's age. Good, actually, it's good at dancing as well. The first the time I've seen her dance. The choreography is very good as well. Pleasant, isn't it? It's very yes, entertaining. Yes. I, I think that's mm -hmm. essentially what I think. A lot of people saw her as an entertainer. So I think she also models and does runways and stuff like that. Okay. So, uh, but hosts a lot of the time and. See, I guess this was like her entry, perhaps, to big, big music, big production mm -hmm. music. Okay. Um, I mean, who, who, what best uh, people from ABS than to to execute such a project? But what's interesting about her is like, certainly it's good production, right? Like in a video like this. But you know, it, all over the world, we've seen good productions and mm -hmm. uh, good choreographies, and then the performances live sometimes fall flat. Yeah. But what's interesting about her is that the performance live is actually, I, I think. Auditory even speaking, better. oh mate, it's a joke. Even better. Yeah. Well, it's very, very. That, that's congratulations, young lady. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think I think she's like twenty three. I don't know. Not too sure. Yeah. So this is from um, from Which what's was? no. So this is from some of uh, uh, a lot of you guys have commented, and uh, it means. Let me show you some of the comments. So it means like. Um, Amaka uh, uh, Kobera is somewhat like slang for slaying. The song basically talks about ignoring what other people's opinions are about you okay. and not confirming to the standard of beauty or society or social media and choosing to be the real, uh, 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 choosing to be the real you, I guess. So then yes. that be where it says, Akoi magiging ako nama king ginusto means like I'll be the me that I would want to be. Yes, yes. Um, and yeah, I know. Thanks for that. No. Yeah, thanks for that, that's what I was at, at the beginning telling you about her authenticity and, yes. and um, her self portrait and, and being herself. Okay, that's good. That's yeah. very good. Impressive. Um, I, I think Ballet said it best in the, in the video we reviewed. Well, but I could Future say. Bright. Yeah, but I could say something about the production. It calls my attention. Mm. So it's amazing. That's it's lots of huge. money, that's lots of people, that's lots of. When I say it's a very well invested artist, it's thinking about who's the production manager is, yeah, and what they think, the way they think that can invest such an amount of money in a production for a very young artist, yeah, yeah. So both things melt together. Uh, the investment, economic investment and the quality of the artist yeah yeah say something about it right? and then is when the champagne bottle pops yes she certainly seems to be doing very well and uh, very good I congratulations think, congratulations to this lady uh yeah i think certainly what best than abs to to guide her in that in that in that process and okay. the, i think she has been involved with them before but star music do have metric load of great artists so i think she's in good hands uh, but yeah, I think we'll be. I think it was just a fun idea to check out kind of like what what's popping for further to kind of see what's trending over there in, in you know in different markets. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, let us know your thoughts and perhaps what other artists would you check out next. I don't know when Bali will be back, but uh, yeah, goodbye. Thank you.